in honor of Diaper Need Awareness Week, it is estimated that at least one in three U.S. families experience diaper need, and one local organization is working to change that. So News 13's Tess Rowland has been filling us in on the Junior League's diaper drive all morning long. Good morning, Tess. Hey, good morning, Erin. Yes, it's approximated that there's around 1,800 Bay County families that actually struggle with this issue. And I mean, a diaper is an essential item. If you have a small child, you probably go through around 8 to 10 each day. And I'm actually joined this morning with a Junior League President-Elect, Miss Sarah Walker. So you started this event six years ago, but you know, it really took off after Hurricane Michael when the area was devastated. Talk to me about, you know, just the impact that you guys have had in this community over the last six years. In the past six years, we've been able to distribute over half a million diapers and training pants to children and families in need. And on average, we give out about um, to about 100 children a month. Wow, that's a huge feat. Thank you for the help in the community in that way. And there's a lot of ways that you can help contribute. You're not only collecting diapers, you're also collecting items like baby wipes. And there's a lot of ways to help. Uh, do you mind talking about the different ways in the community that we can donate? Yeah, so we have several drop-off sites throughout the community going through October 3rd, and people are welcome to come and bring diapers, wipes, or training pants. And they can also donate via our website on jlpanamacity.org, and we have these QR codes on our flyer that they could scan and make a financial contribution if they're able and don't have diapers on hand. Great way, you know, again, you don't need diapers necessarily. You just have to be willing to help. And, you know, talk to me again. You're a mother yourself. You have three boys at home. How does it feel to be able to give back to a mother in need? Yeah, being able to um, provide this service to people in Bay County is really such an essential item that we're really proud to be able to do that. I have three boys, so I know that diapers are very expensive and they're also very necessary. So. Um, the ultimate goal is to end diaper need by providing these diapers and making sure that all the babies have clean diapers to stay healthy. All right. Thank you so much, uh, Miss Walker. And we will have those links and those drop off like locations on our website a little bit later this morning. But for now, live in Panama City, Tess Roland, News 13, Panhandle Strong.